Kevin O'Leary made the right decision by dropping out of the leadership race and he dropped out for one simple reason. Um, he couldn't speak French and he couldn't win in Quebec and communicate with the 25% of Canadians who speak French as a first language. Um, for me, the fact that we attracted so much third party support speaks to the fact that I'm the only candidate in this race that has a chance of defeating Justin Trudeau in the next election. I think this is fabulous for myself because I know that Conservatives are voting for myself. This is a Conservative leadership race and I am the Conservative alternative in this race. I've had Conservative ideas throughout and ones that are common sense and I'm confident that in May uh, I'll be successful in winning the leadership. You mean you're the Conservative alternative to Mr. O'Leary, like he wasn't Conservative enough? Well, Mr. O'Leary said on multiple occasions that he was not a Conservative and, and he and Maxine Bernier share some ideas, whether that be legalizing marijuana or otherwise. I am a conservative alternative in this conservative race, and I know I'll be successful in May. People are up for grabs. I was at an event where the rumor started trickling out, and his two volunteers at that event told me they were supporting me. So certainly, each member that he had joined, if they liked his business, uh, his private sector sort of hard-edged business guy, I worked on Bay Street and these towers here. I haven't been in politics for a decade plus like some in this race. So if they like that outsider and business focus, I can fulfill that as well. So we're going to go after them. Um, Mr. O'Leary and I got along on some business issues. I didn't like his liberal record on other things, but uh, there's more votes than just him.